Hello, I'm Commander Exegius, and today we'll look at unlocking the Guardian ship launch fighters. These fighters are available in three variants, the Javelin outfit with shard launcher, the Trident outfit with a plasma auto cannon, and the Lance outfit with a gauss focus cannon. These fighters are tailor-made for Thargoid content and once unlocked can be outfit to any ship with a ship launch fighter bay. As we'll need to gather several things a good distance from the bubble, you'll want to use a ship with a good jump range and an SRV bay. Something like the Diamondback Explorer or Asp Explorer is very well suited given its jump range and small size, easily landing at Guardian sites. You may also want to ensure you have the ability to synthesize reloads for your SRV ammo as you'll need to dispatch a number of Guardian Sentinels for their materials. You're also going to need a weapon of some kind. I highly suggest an energy weapon such as a small pulse laser. Finally, you'll need a minimum 2-ton cargo bay, but I'd recommend 4 tons so you can obtain the 3 keys you'll need to unlock all 3 fighters, if that's your plan. Now we'll need to gather a bunch of Guardian materials for the unlock. For each fighter, you'll need one Guardian Vessel Blueprint segment, 25 Guardian Power Cells, 26 Pattern Epsilon Obelisk data, and 25 Guardian Technology Components. Then, for each variant, you'll need either Pattern Beta Obelisk data, Guardian Wreckage Components, or Guardian Sentinel Weapon Parts, detailed on screen now. We'll start by heading to a Guardian Ruin site to gather the Pattern Epsilon Obelisk data, heading to a site on Planet B4 in the Call 173 Sector JX-K B24-0. Once there, you'll want to run up and down between the obelisks, scanning the ones that light up blue. Turning off your headlights and even your HUD can ease finding these as you'll see them glow as you approach. Simply jump into your turret, target the obelisk, and scan it with your SRV scanner. Once you've acquired the pattern data, we'll need to head to the Guardian Beacon to obtain the Ancient Key, then head to the Guardian Structure to obtain the Guardian Vessel Blueprint segments. To obtain the key, you'll approach the rather large beacon, charging each of the three pylons using either an energy weapon on your ship or a ship launch fighter. Once all three are charged, the beacon will open rather fantastically, showing you the orb which you'll then scan with your data link scanner. Once scanned, the beacon will eject an ancient key, which you'll need to scoop up by jamming the nose of your ship into the area at the bottom of the beacon. Now that you obtain the key, you'll need to head to the site provided in the message you received from the beacon. Once you arrive at the site, similar to the other sites, you'll need to charge the six pylons located around. A map is on screen now. You'll need to start with the two pylons at the head, charging them first so the others will appear later. As you charge each pylon, several sentinels will appear, which you'll need to dispatch before moving on to the next pylon, collecting any materials they drop. Once you've charged all six pylons, you'll head back to the machine and eject the key on the small pad in front. This will eject the orb, which you'll then scan using your SRV turret, thereby obtaining the Guardian Vessel Blueprint segment. Now that you have the Guardian Vessel Blueprint segment, you'll need to obtain the remaining Guardian items, the 25 Guardian Power Cells and 25 Guardian Technology Components. These can be gathered from both the Sentinel Wreckage and from the destructible panels on the structures and spires that litter the site. Destroy these panels and scoop up these materials either as you charge the beacons or once you've completed the puzzle and destroyed all the sentinels. Now that you've obtained all the necessary materials, you'll need to head to a Guardian Technology Broker to unlock the fighter. These can be found using Inara by going to Galaxy, Systems and Stations, Nearest, then Technology Broker. Once here, enter your current system in Search Near Star System and click Search. Head to the closest Guardian Broker, being sure you choose a station that is nearest its star. Once you arrive at the station, go to Starport Services, Contacts, then Technology Broker. 
Select the fighter you'd like to unlock and simply click Unlock. Once unlocked, you can purchase the fighter in stations with outfitting in a Guardian Technology Broker. Each of the three fighters has its own strength and weaknesses between the Javelin outfit with the Shard Launcher, which is effective against Thargoid Shields and Heart, the Trident outfit with the Plasma Autocannon, which is great to exert the Heart, and the Lance outfit with a Gauss Focus Cannon for pinpoint attacking the Hearts. Hopefully these fantastic looking fighters will assist you in killing Thargoid Interceptors. Once again, this has been Commander Exegius, reminding you to fly dangerously, and thanks for watching. If you found that tutorial on the Guardian Fighters helpful, you should check out my other tutorials on the Thargoids and Guardian content, and join me on my weekly live streams, Tutorial Tuesdays, and the Creators Roundtable every Friday, and I hope you'll consider supporting my efforts via Patreon.